The Red Sea. Exodus chapter 14, page 111. Moses led the Israelites out of Egypt. During the day, God went ahead of them in a pillar of cloud. During the night, God went ahead of them in a pillar of fire. God led the Israelites to the edge of the Red Sea. Pharaoh and his army were close behind. The Israelites did not know what to do. They screamed, We are trapped! What have you done to us, Moses? Moses said, Do not be afraid. God will protect us. God's cloud came between the Israelites and the Pharaoh's army. They could not see anything. God told Moses, Raise your staff over the sea. Then the Lord pushed back the sea to make a path. Moses and the Israelites followed the path through the sea and to the other side. But Pharaoh's army followed close behind. Moses raised his staff again, and the sea swept away Pharaoh and his army. Moses and all the Israelites sang praises to God. They were free. They weren't slaves anymore. The end. Hello, 사랑부. Welcome to our daily devotion. 
Let us start with a prayer. 기도 선 기도해요. Dear God, thank you for today. Let us read your word and through your word, let us know you, let us believe in you, and let us glorify your name. I pray everything in Jesus' name. Amen. So yesterday we learned about God giving 10 plagues to the Pharaoh and Egyptians to free and save Israelites. And we learn that God is powerful, almighty God. And when Israelites were out of Egypt, God led them with the pillar of fire and pillar of cloud. And Pharaoh changed his mind and started, started to follow Israelites to catch them. And while Israelites were running away, there was a red sea blocking them in the front. And they started to complain to Moses. Moses, you are making us die. It was better to live in Egypt than to be free and die here. And Moses says this to the people of Israel who complains. Let's, let us read together. It's Exodus chapter 14, verse 13 through 14. And Moses said to the people, Fear not, stand firm, and see the salvation of the Lord, which He will work for you today. For the Egyptians whom you see today, you shall never see again. The Lord will fight for you, and you have only to be silent. Amen. Moses said, Almighty God who showed ten plagues will fight for you. So don't be afraid. He will save you. And when Moses lifted up the staff, God saved them by dividing up the Red Sea. In today's Bible story, God says that He is the Almighty God, powerful God, who will fight for you to save you. So don't be afraid and just believe in God. Stand firm and see the salvation of God. Even when hard things happen, even when coronavirus is happening at this world, don't be afraid because God is fighting for you to save you. So let us pray at this time for us and our friends, for God to save us, to, to fight for us, for our salvation. Let us pray. Go on. Dear God, you are almighty, powerful God, and you are here with us today. You are fighting for us to save us and free us from all the hardness and from all this coronavirus. Thank you for fighting for us. Thank you for working for our salvation. Let us stand firm in your name. I pray everything in Jesus' name. Amen. Today's craft waves apart. The Lord pushed back the sea to make a path. Trace the waves left to right. Listen for as the people were free. They sang praises to God. Circle the two pictures that begin with the sound, the as sound. The parting of the Red Sea or search and the crossword puzzle. Have fun.